Hello everyone, it's Shane Kanto, your Wasteland reviewer, and I'm here to review Mafia Wars, this new action thriller from writer-director Scott Windhauser, and you get this kind of like, he's a good guy, just in a tough spot, some cops, some CIA agents, the Mafia, a sex worker, and a crazy guy trying to destroy the system. What do you get? You get Mafia Wars. And this action thriller is overly convoluted, overly complicated, yet obviously predictable when it's like, there's a twist. I'm like, saw that one coming. It's such an interesting concoction of like, they try to do so many things in this like hour and 37 minute movie, but it's also clunky and put together. There's a lot of explosions in this for a movie that has very low budget and has horrible special effects for those explosions. The action is not particularly interesting or engaging. There's not really a whole lot of suspense. And so many of these characters are so paper thin when it's like they get shot in the head, you're just like, okay, who was that? There are some moments, there are some characters that you might connect with, with a little bit. And some of them are really trying to do their best to make most of this really clunky, awkward, unconvincing dialogue that they're forced to, you know, spout out. The biggest selling point is Tom Welling. It has Superman. It has Clark Kent from Smallville. And I think he's fine. Like, there's nothing particularly interesting or dynamic about his character. He plays this archetype, and he plays it tough and, you know, tough. I feel like Cam... Gigandet, who plays the main antagonist, he's hamming it up so much that, like, yeah, he's actually kind of fun to watch. Um, he's like, I'm so unpredictable in a most predictable kind of way. And you're just like, of course he's going to, like, turn on everybody. Duh. But at least he's entertaining to watch. You have Cher Cazenza, who plays Finx, this sex worker or... Maybe there's more to her. She gets drugged along a lot for this film. You have a lot of characters. You have a lot of angles. There's a lot of cooks in this kitchen of conspiracy, drug pushing, and mafioso type things. And at the end of the day, it's not really super effective in many ways. If you like a good old fashioned, like straight to VOD action thriller, this checks all those boxes, but it doesn't really do anything particularly well to make this an like one that you're going to stick with or remember afterwards or leave you with anything in particular. Sometimes you could get like a really big name and you're just like, oh my God, Mickey works in this. This one has Tom Welling and the rest of the cast and some of them are hamming it up and making it entertaining enough. But in general, this is a this is a miss. This is one of those like easily passable action thrillers you have there on VOD. But those are my thoughts on Mafia Wars. Let me know what you think and let's talk some movies. But thank you as always for tuning in to one of your Wasteland Reviewer.